what is up guys we are back with another video uh today we're gonna try to do some more crappie fishing i'm over here to my spot i like to go to under the bridge uh it's right at the crack of dawn it's around like 5 uh 20 it's right now sun's not completely up but this is what i want we're gonna go out here and try to cast and see what we can get real quick and hopefully we get something good See you guys down the water. All right, guys. So, try to put our mineral on. Water level is still a little low, a little lower than it normally is. And the thing about being under this bridge is that, uh, You got limited space, but also you got to try to cast There we go, that's actually a decent cast right there. You got to try to fix that at the top of the pile right there. So let me get the next, next rod set up. Bring this out. Said I haven't really. The last few times I came out here, ever really caught in a lot. But I'm hoping that changes today. So. We're gonna go on this side right here and try to throw. I'm just gonna throw this here right now. Just kind of throw right there for a second. Because this wind is really strong and it's blowing my cork. all over the place. All right. We're gonna try to throw a wave back here in the deep part. Right there. On that one. Some chicken liver somebody dropped right here on the ground. Hey guys, so we just got a bite on this uh, red cork. It just went under for just a second and popped back up. We're gonna see if it, it goes down again. Um, I haven't really had any bites besides that. There it goes, she just went under. And there we go. Just nice bass. Nice bass in here. Okay. So, first catch was in the crappie with. <clears throat> Splash in my face. But I'm hoping just to wake everything up. There we go, let me get a good shot in there for you. There we go. It's about a nice, about what, about two pound probably. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get in the middle way back out and uh, get this guy back. See you guys in a sec. All right guys, we're baited up after catching the bass. I just gotta uh, just keep, don't get shallow. Cause I was like right here. 
by the pylons where I cast it out. It's gonna let that stay right there. And I'm gonna check this rod right here. And uh, try to cast a little bit deeper underneath the pylon. This is, this is cleaned off. So we're getting another one on right here. Cause I, like I knew if it, I guess I know there's fish under here, man. Uh, because I guess I keep seeing all these different uh, splashes and pops on the top of the water. So I know something's feeding under here. So we're gonna go back get under here again that was not a good throw I'm under there but not as deep as I wanted to be so I'm gonna throw a little bit deeper I'm really trying to get back underneath if I can Let's see there we go All right, guys. Dang it. I had a fish on and I just lost it. I had a big fish on and I lost it just now. Caught me off guard. It was a nice one, but I, don't, I think you just, I barely had it hooked. <sighs> it just got off. I, had, I was trying to start the film, button with one hand and then catch with the other cat, dog it. I just missed a nice big one, and I, I don't know if that was a bass, and I think it was a bass. And I can't really set the hook. I was scared to set it because then it was a crappie, I didn't want to rip the lip off, or rip the, the lip open, so. <sighs> Joke's on me. All right. I just saw my, my rod move straight, like something hit it. And then when I picked it up, it was about to go in the water. I hate I didn't film that from the beginning, but it happens. Like I said, I can't film along because this camera overheats so quick, so quickly. Let me throw out here again. Recheck this one. Who in the world is that noise? I keep hearing. But honestly, it felt like a bass. More so than the crappie. Yeah, this one's cleaned off. So we'll see if we can get another one to hit. All right, fresh minnow. On the, on the pole. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep, I'm just gonna keep this one shallow. Cause they're coming through right there. On that end. All right, I'm pulling this up. I just put the orange one back in, the orange cork. Uh, so from throw this back out towards the inside. Try to see if we can get something. Oops, I almost broke my right. Something right here. I don't want to break this. It's too expensive there. And I'll leave that right there. That's what the other one hit last time. Kind of right there where that one's at. So, leave that there for a minute. And hopefully, one of these will get a hit soon. this like I said because the battery overheats and it's also draining faster so I'm gonna say this battery once we get a hit I'm gonna turn it back on or at least a sign of a hit 
we'll go from there. All right, so I'm gonna uh, recast one of these back out because they're getting a little too close together with the lines. I'm trying to keep the. Oops. Oh, I did break this. No. I did break this a rod. I didn't bring my spare one. Got to dog it. When I stepped on it, I broke it. Man, devastated. Someone told me to take that third ride and I didn't do it. This broke when I just stepped on it. Man, it's one of those days. And I don't have money to replace this right now. Jeez. And guys, this is why you fish with more than one pole. Prime example, oops. I'm gonna leave that middle right there. Just for a second. Oh my goodness. Yep, something just hit right there. I'm gonna throw right there in that spot. Money. Let's see if we can catch something right here. There's something right there. Just saw the wave. Okay, let's take a time to hit. Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, man, come on, yo. That was it. And that's and that's definitely a uh, crappie right there or something. That was it. After breaking that rod, man, I gotta have a good. I gotta have a good day now. I gotta have a good day. Cause I know there's something right there. Because they got hit quick. There we go. Got it again. There we go. Not losing it this time. And we got us a nice channel cat right here. Nice channel cat. All right, come now, fella. All right. What's in expecting this? But we got it nevertheless. All right, so that's a nice channel cake. We're actually gonna keep him. And we're gonna keep going out. Let's see what, we, what else we can get you in this, uh, in this shallows. I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's a snake sticking his, oh, it just went down. There's a snake sticking his head right out the water for the longest time. It was like sticking, there he goes, it just went up again. I do know where 
most likely gonna come up at. Cause right where my stuff is, that's where um, the snake will sometimes pop up. It's been a minute since I've seen a snake it's like just stand on his tail, like sticking straight up like that. That's the first time. Then I'm gonna fly on top of the water, but that one was just like legit standing, like just watching. Like it was really weird. So that means I need to be careful. And watch where I'm standing. And honestly, I wonder if that's what I, if that's what I hooked earlier, was that snake. Cause this is the exact spot from his post where he got a bite. I don't know, I just know it was, it was just pulling weird. I don't know. Like I said, I'm just trying to be careful. Cause honestly, I was expecting to see a snake. I just saw it. I know I'm in this territory though. Just, I just gotta be careful. I'm right, gonna say this battery is getting low. Trying to watch this snake around here. It keeps coming back. All right, be back in a minute. All right, guys, we're back. There's something big hanging around here. That's just something, something huge. Just take off underneath the, uh, this pile line. Trying to see if I can get a hit right there. We'll see. Uh, I don't know what it is. There's some just feeding right there. Could be a bass or a catfish. Yeah, something. Yeah, I just saw something right there in the distance on that left side. So I may move and just uh, fish that edge right there. And since everything seems to be hitting on that side, so that's all that's on this uh, right side over here where I'm at. It's uh, pretty much this snake popping and popping around right here. So, there we go. Get a hit. Take down. And I got it on camera. Finally, small bass, but it's better than nothing. All right, we're gonna put this guy back in the water. Get another one on. Yeah, I'm gonna move on this way. And just fish the shallows. Move over here. Okay, guys, this is all we got today. Uh, both nice, you know, skitter size fish. Uh, you know, we got the large, we got the large mouth, and we got the uh, channel cat. Uh, that's pretty much it. We got. Uh, I see you guys a nice meal. Anyway, uh, I just wish we could have got more. We could have had three if I could have got uh, just put a little more tension on that line on that big one we missed earlier. Well guys, we didn't catch any crappie, but we did get something. We got, we were getting bites. Uh, just, I just said I missed a few, but hey, that's fishing. 
anyway uh hopefully next time i get a little bit more for you guys uh if you guys like this video make sure to like share subscribe drop a comment down below let me know what you think tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend till next time i'll see you guys peace